Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi. My name is Charlotte, I'm a registered nurse and today I'm going to be showing you everything that I keep inside my nursing bag. <laughs> Before we get into everything, <laughs> Don't forget to like, subscribe, do all of that good stuff, but for now, let's dive right in. So, this is my nursing bag. It's just a bag that I got from Kmart in vanilla colour. It costs $22, which I think is pretty good. And it also came with like a laptop case, which I'll show you. It also came with this really cute laptop case. So that's just the inside, and then it's got, um, just a pocket in the front as well. So this came with the bag. I bought it because I thought it was really, really pretty. It's also got long enough handles that I can loop it over my shoulder and it doesn't feel tight, it doesn't catch or anything. And also it's kind of waterproof and durable. So that's why I bought it. See, at $22 from Kmart, I feel like it's pretty good. So the first thing that I keep inside my nursing bag <laughs> is my wallet. This is the one that I got for Christmas from mum and dad. It's by Moana Road. It's really, really cute. It's baby pink and it's just got your spare tissues in there. So it's got the front pocket and then inside it's got all of my stuff. So it's got the middle pocket for cash and stuff. I keep Jenna's vaccination record in here and then all of my little cards and stuff. So I keep my wallet in my bag. Next thing I keep is my keys. These are my key rings. First off, I've got my little fluffy pink rabbit. This I got from Yo Yo So. It was a little bit expensive, but it's so soft and it's the cutest thing ever. And because it's so fluffy, if I'm like fumbling around in my bag, it's pretty easy to tell which one's my car keys. So I got my cute little pink rabbit. I've got my Minnie Mouse smoothie cone thing, which I got off Timu. I've got my Care Bear keyring, my Chia Bear keyring, and on it it says, enjoying my life drama free so i got that one from typo this one my sister bought me it's a courage bunny i don't know if you can see it's a courage bunny so i've got that from hannah also from hannah this rose quartz crystal caring which she says um symbolizes like love and friendship and stuff so i've got that and then i've got my keys so that's my car keys and then this is my key for my steering wheel lock so second thing is my keys the next thing that i keep inside my bag is a book so this is the book that i'm currently reading it's before the coffee gets cold by toshikazu kawaguchi i hope i've said that right so this is a collection of four short stories set in the same place and everything about this little coffee shop where if you sit up at a particular table you can go back in time and have a conversation with someone as long as that person has already been to the cafe and you have to come back to the present time before your coffee gets cold or you turn into a ghost that's the book that i'm in at the moment so i always keep a book in my bag because i'll often read at lunch time because i get an hour lunch break so i've got that this is a bit random this has just been in my bag for a while now but it's this <laughs> printout of this is that what they call a journal essay um, on medication right so i just have that randomly sitting in my bag as well i have a spare shopping bag so this one has got the breast screen midland contact details and stuff because i got it as a freebie from one of my study days so it's really cute because it bundles up into the little pouch so if I'm in to go to pack and save after work then I've at least got one bag and then this is like my miscellaneous package so it's just an old makeup bag that I have lying around but I just keep pretty much everything else in it so if I open it up let's have a look at my little goodies first thing spare pad and I think I've also got a spare tampon in here as well I have got some tissues hand sanitizer is coming to the end of this one but it's my cherry blossom scenting one i have got a pack of ibuprofen and a pack of paracetamol two little pens so i've got a red and a black pen in here as well i've got a mini mirror i got this from my auntie denise for christmas one year it needs a bit of a clean to signal <laughs> 
cats. If you don't live in New Zealand, this little bird is a piwaka waka or a fantail and they are so cute. They are the most beautiful little birds ever. Um, so yeah, I've got this little compact mirror, another pack of paracetamol that's coming to the end of its life. I have a mini sample of my favourite mascara. So this is the Charlotte Tilbury Push Up Lashes. So if I ever need like a mascara touch up, I've got it in my bag. And then I've got my Glow Recipe um, Lip Pot. This is also coming to the end because I just used it all the time. Like that's literally how much it's got left. I'm going to have to start scooping it out. And then I have got oh, another lip balm. This is my Nivea SPF one. It tastes disgusting, but um, I find I get dry lips really, really easily and very quickly. They're very painful, so I prefer to have that and it tastes disgusting rather than painful chat clips so I've got two mini highlighters I've always found these really handy especially on like placements and stuff and when I'm doing study days if we get given like handout sheets these are always quite nice to have so I've got two mini highlighters those ones were from Typo I got them years ago and they used to smell really good and they don't anymore <laughs> I've got some medical tape so this is one that I had gotten from Auckland Hospital when I was on placement. And it's really cool. It's not a paper tape, but you just tear it and it comes off perfectly. So yeah, I've got some medical tape in my bag. And the last thing I have in my little mini suitcase is this little hairbrush. And I have used this before I go into work and stuff just to kind of give it a little touch up, make it smooth. So that's everything that I keep in here in my little suitcase. This is actually it's so handy to have because I used to just have a tote bag and not I didn't have this and I just put everything loose and it was a nightmare to find stuff especially when you're in a rush and you need things so having everything just in this little compact um, makeup bag is it's just so helpful and it's just amazing so I've got this and then the last thing that I kind of keep in my bag is my Barbie umbrella so when you open it up um, it's hot pink on the inside and it's got like little Barbie icons in it um, and then the strap is pink and it just looks like a plain umbrella on the outside. So yeah, I've got my umbrella as well. So that's everything that I keep in my bag. And then obviously I bring my lunch with me as well. So I'll always have my little lunch box and stuff. I meal prep or I try to meal prep every Sunday so that I've got everything ready for the rest of the week. So I just take my lunch out of the fridge, shove it into my bag and it's all ready to go. I don't bring any cutlery to work because everything like our staff room has everything. So just bring my lunch box. And then I also bring my drink bottle there's a little patch just there so I'm just gonna turn it around so it looks cute so I also got this one from Kmart it's a Stanley mug ripper I also got this from Kmart this one was $19 and it's honestly like the best thing ever I get through like two of these a day so yeah I also bring my drink bottle with me to work and then that's pretty much everything that I bring in my nursing bag this baby fits all of that stuff in is there anything else to say I don't think so. I think that was today's video. As I say, short and sweet. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys keep in your nursing bag or your work bag. You know, I always find it fascinating. I feel like everybody's bag is so different and like what we keep in it really reflects like our personalities and everyday life and stuff as well. But you know what I mean? Like I just feel like everyone will keep different things in their bags and stuff. So let me know what you guys keep in your work bags and leave it in the comments. <laughs> so yeah, that was today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, do all of that good stuff. I will see you next Monday with a new video. But until then, have a lovely day and a fabulous week. Bye! It's rated X. That means you're extra, extra.